Hey, what's up guys? Um, today I'm gonna be showing you how to install um, the X-Ray mod for Minecraft 1.2.4 Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Um, let's just go into the link I have in the description for you uh, it's, it's gonna be add file link So let's go go ahead and uh, open that up So once you guys open it, there's gonna be plenty of new ads here So let me just go ahead and refresh this page uh, if you see any ads saying like download now, click here to download, those are just ads, but as you can see up in this corner, it starts at 5 and then goes all the way down to 0. So just go ahead and uh, then you'll have the opportunity to hit skip ad or to click it uh, as you wish to say it. So let me just go ahead and click skip ad, then your download should begin down here or up here. And uh, I forgot to say, but you will also need mod loader for this. I will also have the description the link in the in the description for you guys to download if you haven't already done so so do you want to uh, open or save I'm just going to click save I recommend saving it as save it to my desktop I've already have it saved as you can see what I told you guys save so I'm just going to hit no for but as I've already have it but and uh, for the mod loader link well, it will also be an ad fly so it's same for the same things plenty of ads uh, starts at five and goes all the way down to zero. Then you have you can just go ahead and skip add you down to begin down here or up here or down in this corner or wherever your download should be start uh, loading up. So once you've got a uh, mod loader for 1.2.4 and uh, Minecraft um, X-ray mod, so then you're just gonna go ahead and go into your uh, log it, launch Minecraft. Then you're gonna go options. Force update done and log in. Okay, I recommend it doing a force update because there is a possibility that when you that uh, that you will get a black screen because sometimes if you have more some mods, uh, won't, they won't record, they won't like work well together. So I recommend doing a force update. But it's up to you guys. Uh, so, but or if you ever install this guy mod, it doesn't work. So go ahead, go options force update. Then uh, go. Then log in. Then your Minecraft.jar will be back set back to its original state. So uh, if you wish to do to do a force update, then just go ahead. And if when you've done when you're done doing the force update, you can just go ahead and close out of Minecraft. Then go search programs and files. You're gonna hold Shift and hit the number five, which will give you a percentage sign or whatever your percentage sign is. Then you're gonna go percentage A P P D A T A. So percentage A app data percentage and just go ahead and hit enter and this will open up then you can just go into your minecraft dot minecraft I mean then into your bin folder and then you're gonna go ahead and just go find your minecraft you click it once if, if you double click it it's no point of doing that but if you click it once it will be highlighted then you'll be able to right click it and you, you then you can just go ahead and go open with winwar R, winwar archiver if you do if you don't have winwar archiver then uh, so look up a video on how to install it. I don't have a video on how to install it. Um, I'm not quite sure. I looked up a tutorial and I found out how to do it. But you guys can just go ahead and do that. Then once you get your Minecraft.jar open, you can just go ahead and go delete. Uh, click it once again so it's highlighted. Then you go right click, delete, delete files. Or you can just go ahead and click delete up here and hit yes. Uh, this will get rid of your meta M folder. The M folder, it's a folder, it's like an anti mod thing, or it's like it doesn't work well. But in it, all of the other videos, will all say you tell you the same thing to delete meta if so it's not just me, all other mods will tell you to do the same thing. So then you can just go ahead and open up mod loader, then click and drag all these, it's all these class files from vx.class all the way up to adl.class. So click and drag all these class files. You don't need this top folder up here. So make uh, this part. Make sure not not to drop them up here, because there because there is a possibility that you will drop them into one of the, these file folders, which will make your Minecraft crash. So just make sure to drop them up down here. So just hit OK. This will make it this. So they just drop down here. There's no possibility of them falling into one of the folders, and you can just go ahead and close out of modloader. Dot zip, and then go ahead and open up Minecraft X-ray. Out of this. So go ahead and open up mod, uh, Minecraft X-Ray mod for 1.2.4. Now this is a pretty small folder. Just go ahead and 
uh, it's a from click and drag all these class files again so click and drag didn't drop them down here same process don't drop them up here because there's a possibility of them crashing give me a second someone calling my name yeah uh, so that's pretty much it so once you launch up minecraft everything will be work fine and that's pretty much it feel free to uh, leave a like if this video helped you guys out you may uh, if you have any problems on this launch leave me a comment and I'll do my best to help you guys out that's pretty much it uh, you can click that subscribe button at the end of the video I do post daily daily um, videos and you can, at the end of the video you'll have the option to click on one of the videos at the one of the my next videos but yeah guys you guys have a nice day peace